Hey everybody, this is Brian from PMB Homesteading again. I'm out here on the lower deck and I wanted to show you the uh, transition of some of these uh, plants we've got. So, you may notice there's a new table out here. I took the, uh, the kale that was sitting down here and I moved it up, put it onto its own table because I wanted to bring out some uh, friends for it. So you may notice that these are the Vates kale that used to be inside and now they've been out here on our deck for the last few days and you can see they've really grown back because you know remember in the last video I said that uh, when Paula got back from her trip we were going to harvest off this and uh, we harvested it and being out here in the sun it's really taken off so we've got some really big growth on this one over here too just in the last few days I put some new fertilizer in just right before I started filming some of the organics that I use but uh, we just had this one we had some red. This is the red Russian kale. We had this one, the white Russian kale in this box, as well as the uh, kale over here. I can't remember if that's the uh, the old Vates kale or if that's the. I can't remember if they called that one the dinosaur kale. And then we had some of the uh, the beta salad mix. You can see a bunch of it starting to go to seed over here. So we're letting that go to seed in the back back there, and then the uh, arugula is flowering. So it's going to seed. We'll keep there, capture that seed and throw it down inside the box right here to get the second season growing from its own seed, which is good. And then uh, we've been harvesting off the uh, the spinach. A couple of these spinach got broke off when I was putting the fertilizer in, so you know, I'll just let those rot right there. <laughs> and then, oh, and then the, uh, remember how I thought there was uh, something eaten on these? On the, uh, the chard. Well, it turns out that there's these little finches that come along and they're poking holes in it. And so they were sitting up here, they were sitting on the kale itself, and they were taking their beaks and they were poking holes and tearing it out of there. And I haven't found any bugs or anything living on this stuff. That's why I was so curious. And then Paul and I were sitting out here last night, you know, uh, having an adult beverage on the deck. And these little finches just came flying up and they sat on top of this kale, uh, chard and they started just poking holes in it with their beaks. <laughs> so I thought, I thought, you know, that's fine. We'll let these little guys get enough nutrients and you know, we got plenty to share. But uh, yeah, so it wasn't slugs and it wasn't the, uh, the white uh, moth, but it was the, uh, the little finches. We got some in here, they got a little sunburn from last week. We still got to snap some of this out. I'm mean, coming through here and pulling these out and cleaning up things today. Getting rid of the ones that have the holes in them. But uh, I figure if I leave a few of them that have the holes, that means that the uh, the birds will attack those first. Hopefully. And of course, here we got our spinach. We got a salad on this. Actually, no, it wasn't a salad. What do we have? We had something. I think she, she sauteed some eggs. She sauteed it with some mushrooms. That's right. And then she put it in a uh, like an egg burrito. We had that on Friday morning. It was really good. The spinach is really good. I mean, it's got really nice big leaves. And we haven't had any really hot, hot weather to where it's caused it to bolt, but you can see that it's already it's already in the shade at this point. And it's almost 3 o'clock, so it's not going to get that really hot afternoon sun, whereas that one over there, that spinach may actually bolt this next week because we're going to have some days that are supposed to be up in the, the high 80s or maybe even into the 90s. Well, that's kind of the update for the... Uh, lower deck here all right well it's been brian from pmb homesteading talk to you guys again bye